Hey everybody, it's Bunny! And I'm back! I'm not much to look at today, or listen to, but at least I'm alive! I caught the bronchitis, which I didn't even think was contagious. I thought you had to have like another thing first, and then like if you got worse, it would transform into bronchitis. But quite apparently, I just started out with bronchitis. Excuse me, cough break. Breathing is like one of the top 10 most difficult things to do. I have missed you guys so, so much all this week. I had all these marvelous plans. I really intended to have a video up on Wednesday, but I started really running a bad fever Tuesday night. I just, I haven't been sleeping. And guess who just became a full-fledged member of the Inhaler Club? Yes. Uh, do you have an inhaler? because I do. I am so susceptible susceptible to lung things. Like, just, this is disgusting. This is TMI, but just like if pneumonia, I would get it. Like I've had pleurisy, lung plugs. There's a real thing called a lung plug. It's horrifying. I'm at the creepy school again today. And look, the gate is open. It kind of makes me want to walk around a little bit in there, but I don't, maybe, maybe not. What have you guys been up to? Have you had a good week? Have you had a bad week? Just, are some of you still on spring break? <laughs> Excuse me. Sippy, sippy. Did you bring your tea? Ah. Delicious. I don't know if this happens to you guys, but just like anytime I get sick, just the face demons, everywhere they come to attack with a vengeance and i've just been driving myself crazy looking at pictures of makeup on the internet and watching makeup tutorial videos because that's probably the number one most missed thing that happens to me when i'm sick i just want to put all the makeup on my face but i don't feel good enough to do it and also like contamination it's kind of disgusting how about though people that honk like two seconds after the light is green like that just happened to me just driving over here and like the the light had just turned green and like literally I was moving my foot from the brake to the accelerator and they were honking already I just I don't know and then like all this weird stuff I'm seeing in my car why do I have an emergency service pin just that horrifies me where did this come from I don't know I'm sorry. I hate to disappoint you guys. I had so many fun videos planned. I really, before I was stricken with this illness, I had been starting to like organize more things for more fashion posts and outfit of the days and awesome stuff like that. So that is to come. And I also had everything all laid out and planned out for a mail hurl. And I actually intended on doing a wreck it Wednesday for Wednesday, but nothing happened. So just all that is coming next week. What else is up? What else is up? I've just been kind of crazy. Like I start to develop all these like weird tics when I'm sick. Like I start like doing weird things. Like sometimes when I feel really bad, like especially when I've got a fever, like I start mumbling out loud to myself. There are so many people behind me. I mean, not people, but cars happening. I'm seeing it out of my peripheral. <laughs> I, I like I'll start like making up weird songs that I'll sing out loud. To myself and then other people will hear them and be like what are you saying like i'll just like start making noises or saying fruits like bananas bananas mangoes and i'll just like out of my mouth just mm, word vomit also like i've been doing this thing i suppose in my loneliness and isolation like do you ever start to friendicize about people like you fantasize about how awesome it would be if you were friends with someone in real life you guys know i've been into like into charles dickens lately so like do you ever just think about some of these actors and you're like i wonder what they are like like in real life like you know like just are they fun? Could we make cupcakes together, maybe? I don't know, I wanna start a fan club for this one character and this one actor. Maybe if you're British, you will know who this is. Bleak House, which totally obsessed with, it's on Netflix. If you have Netflix, you should watch it. It's 15 parts long. I know from comments, a lot of y'all have been sick out there. So if you're in need of some entertainment, watch Bleak House. It's 15 episodes long. Oh my goodness, I've been so obsessed with this character and this actor who plays this character of Mr. Guppy. And I think in real life, his name is Burn. Just what kind of a person is named that? But you know, 
Like, it's just, and it would seem really cool. I just, I would like to be friends with everyone on the television. Just, do you have anyone that you're like that? Woo! Okay, I had to stop for a second because my screen on my phone went black. I had no idea. I thought it was dying, but it, in fact, is overheating from the sun because finally summer in Texas has arrived. It's hot here. Well, I mean, it's the temperature that I like. Today, it's 85 degrees outside, but it feels a lot hotter. I really have nothing important or of merit to say, except for I have missed you guys so much. And I know a lot of y'all have been posting on Facebook and stuff that you're like getting concerned if I fell into a black hole. I don't think I've had a video up all week, which is so abnormal for my life. We should be back on track today. I'm going to maybe try and put makeup on later. Just my face. My face! I'm so frustrated with my face! <laughs> oh, strange man. Let's look at him. What are you doing, strange man? Oh, you can't see the strange man. Strange man. Strange man. There he goes. Being strange. I've got a giraffe in my car. Just, do you, just, giraffe, giraffe, giraffe. Random, random, scrambled eggs. Anyway, I will see you guys tomorrow. And uh, thank y'all so much for watching and for sticking with me and for showing concern, checking up on me on Facebook or Twitter, or Instagram or anywhere else. I truly, truly appreciate it. And it greatly means a lot to me and cheers me up when I am alone and sick and sad. I love you guys so, so much. And I will see y'all tomorrow. Bye.